Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. For today's video we're doing yet another cook and clean with me. And I hope this video will give you guys some awesome cleaning motivation. And yeah, we're going to go ahead and jump right in. And I'm going to start off this video by tidying up the dining room. What you do Alrighty, now that space is all done, I'm going to move on to the living room. And I don't know if you guys have noticed in my last couple of cooking and cleaning videos that we rearranged our living room furniture just to kind of change it up a little bit. And I actually really, really like how we did it. Now that the living room is all finished, I'm going to move on to the kitchen and I just had a couple of dishes that I had drying that I needed to put up and then I'm going to go ahead and get started on cleaning some dishes in the sink as well. Ooh, we're the only ones who really 
I've been trying to take my eyes off you. Oh, girl, it ain't easy. Just let go of that body. Why you gotta keep flirting like you do? I waited so patiently, but you don't seem sorry. I sing a little to you. Try so for tonight's dinner, I wanted to do something super simple and I'm going to be making a spicy pan seared chicken. You can choose to make it just like a regular pan seared chicken with maybe some Italian seasoning, salt and pepper, but I felt like spicing things up a bit by adding in some cayenne pepper. And then I'm also going to be making my super easy macaroni and cheese. Just say I'm here for you I'm working overtime I'm more than nine to five Come on, let your clothes drive Down to the floor I wanna see you moving slowly To the music We'll be dimming the lights Then lock the door I know it sounds crazy But hey, we're gonna do it Come on, yeah Sing a little bit Trying to make some plans Trying, baby Come on, baby, let it be you Hope that you will understand I think that if you get to know me You see, I'm way more than nice I wanna hold you Let me feel you Till the morning light I'm more than just nice So while I wait for the pasta to cook, I'm going to go ahead and start my broccoli. This is just a frozen bag of broccoli from Kroger. I just have to put that in the microwave to get that to cook. To add a little bit of extra flavor to the chicken, I'm going to add in a little bit of butter because honestly, what dish isn't improved by a little bit of butter or bacon? Bacon's always good to add into something as well, but I wanted to add that in. And then another tip that I want to give you guys is that if your chicken isn't cooked all the way through, I like to pop it in a preheated oven at about 400 degrees just to finish cooking it all the way through on the inside because you don't want your chicken to be super dry on the outside and undercooked on the inside. Once the pasta is done cooking, I'm going to strain that out, return it back to the pot, and I'm going to reduce the heat down to medium low and then I'm going to add in my favorite shredded cheese. I usually like to add in two cheeses but I didn't realize I was out of cheddar when I was filming this video but typically I will use cheddar cheese and Monterey Jack but on this video I'm going to be using Monterey Jack and American.
So here is the dinner all cooked with my macaroni and cheese, broccoli, and chicken. So now that dinner is all done, I'm going to go ahead and pack up the leftovers for Charlie's lunch tomorrow. And that is going to finish this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button down below. Subscribing is completely free and I'd really appreciate it if you help me grow my channel. And thank you so much for stopping by and I hope to see you guys soon. Love ain't got nothing on me, bad boy.